Hey everyone, welcome back again. Thanks for watching my tutorials. Do you have any questions related to my tutorials or anything, you can ask me in your own language. I can speak all languages of the world. So, if you don't know English, it's perfectly fine. In this tutorial I will show you how to make this kind of text animation in After Effects. Let's have a look. Open After Effects and create a new composition. I am using 1920 by 1080, at 30 frames per seconds, you can choose according to your need. Create a new solid for our background. I am using very light color. But you can use any image, or color of your choice. Now we are going to add effect. If you don't found your effects tab, go to windows and select effects and presets. Search for Venetian blinds effects, and add it to your background layer. Let's change few settings of this effect. Change transition completion to 6. And direction to minus 45. Change width to 10. This effect will add pattern lines in your background. But these lines are transparent, you can see behind these lines. Add another solid with darker color than this background layer. And put it behind the background layer. Because it is solid, you can always change its color. light, dark, faded or anything. Let's keep this for now. It's time to add your text. You can add any text you want, single word or even a paragraph. Go to Windows and select a line. Align it to the center. Change color of your choice. By the way, you can download this free font from link in the description. Now, we are animating this text. I am using masking technique. Create a new rectangle shape. Make sure you have not selected any layer. Change fill to solid color. And stroke to none. Make sure to change the fill color to black. Make this rectangle shape over the text to cover it. If you don't find this track mat tab here, right click and select the mode, or press F4. In your text layer change track mat to alpha mat. Now your text will be visible in this shape only. Select your shape layer and press S to scale it. Click on this link icon and change width to 50%. Select move tool and shift this shape mask to the left. So that it will cover half of your text. Select shape and text layer, and press Ctrl plus D to duplicate them. It will automatically create new copy with mask. Now place this shape mask to the right. So that your text will be covered by these shapes. Make sure to not leave any gap between. Now select both your text layers, and press P to open position. Go to 3 seconds and click on this stopwatch icon to add keyframe. 
come back to 2 seconds and change positions for both layers like I am doing. This is your animation. Let's ramp preview this. Press N to trim the comp timing to play only this part. Let's easy ease these keyframes to make our animation look more attractive. Open graph editor, select these keyframes and click on this icon. It will make them easy ease. Select keyframe and adjust it like this. Let's preview this and you will see this kind on smooth animation. Perfect. Now we are adding stroke animation. Make sure to unselect all your layers and select shape tool. Change fill to none. And stroke to solid color. Chain stroke size to 5. And draw it around the text. I am changing my stroke color to the same text color. Let's change stroke size to 15, for more thickness. And align it to the center. Now select your stroke layer and click on add. Select trim paths. Open this trim path style and add keyframe to start from 100% to 0%. Arrange these keyframes according to text animation. So it will end at the time of text animation starts. Again open graph editor and easy ease these keyframes as well. Ram preview again. Perfect. You can turn on the motion blur of these animated layer, switch motion blur icon for each layers. This looks good to me. Let's move to the last step. Now adding shine effect to this text. This step is optional, you can skip it if you want. Select all layers except background layers, and pre-compose them. Open this pre-compose and add a new adjustment layer on top of them. Go to effect and search for CC light sweep effect. Add this effect to the adjustment layer. This effect will add shine effect to the text. Change edge thickness to zero. You can animate this light with this point. Add a keyframe to the center and move it like this. You can always play with the settings and make it to look good to you. Add some detailing and you are done.
Thanks for watching this tutorial, I will see you in the next tutorial. If you are still watching this video, tell me in the comments where are you from.